Are you ready to tell us your story? I read my close-up, Mr. whatever his name was. I am a hundred and eight now. I was born in 1914, not far from Mossman Bay. My mother was very pretty and my father was handsome. He drove cars in Africa and uh, I think he instilled in me a desire for adventure. The dance I really loved most of all was not one of those interesting modern creations. It was the Blue Daddy Waltz. Madame's choreography was so good, it had so much in it that we simply loved it. And we usually did it at the end of a performance. Da, 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 da. If, if you could give one piece of advice to young people today, what, what would you tell them? Work hard. Learn your dance. Take notice of what your teacher says and also Start inventing things for yourself. Can't think of anything else. That's good. I'll try to get out having to go to jobs if you have to. Try to get rich parents. <laughs> but the great thing about practicing an art is what that does to you and what it gives to you. You don't need anything else, really. You know, I, I still bless the day when I first saw Madame Bowden Pisa. She brought so much happiness and beauty into my life. I've not stopped, I've never stopped being a Bowden Pisa dancer. So there you have me, there I am. A moment is a dance forever. Fantastic. Thank you. I like this part of it. Thank you. Break, please. I lost my hanky. Oh, yeah.